what is up welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi i'm maddie i run edtech classroom the blog podcast and of course youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be sharing how to convert a powerpoint file into a google slides file and then at the end of today's video i'll show you how to do the opposite turning a google slides file into a powerpoint file now there's a couple different reasons why you might want to do this conversion. For me personally, I am a big Google Slides user. I don't find myself using PowerPoint really ever. I don't even have PowerPoint on my computer anymore. So this trick is really handy for me as a teacher. I oftentimes purchase products on Teachers Pay Teachers and many of those products are PowerPoint files and I use this trick to be able to edit them in Google Slides. So without further ado, let's get started. Right now I am inside of my Google Drive and I am in a folder that I would like to save these files to. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to walk you through the steps on how to convert a PowerPoint file into a Google Slides file first. So again, we're in my Google Drive right now. I got here just by going to drive.google.com and I selected the folder that I want to save my files to. Now what we are going to do is we're going to upload the PowerPoint file to our Google Drive. So to do this, there's a couple different ways you can upload a PowerPoint file. First, you can drag and drop it into the folder or you can go over here to the top left-hand corner and click on this button that says new and then click on file upload. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to look for that file saved on my computer. It is this file right here that's titled conversation starters and morning meeting shares. So this is the PowerPoint file that I want to convert to Google Slides. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on open in order to upload it to my Google Drive. Now you will see inside of my Google Drive, we have this PowerPoint file saved here. The way I know that it is a PowerPoint file is first it has this PowerPoint icon. And then second, it says in the file name .pptx, which is the file name or the file type for PowerPoint. So now that we have uploaded the PowerPoint file to our Google Drive, we are going to open it up so we can begin the process of converting it to Google Slides. So to open it up, you can just double click and you'll see that a Google Slides interface is loading for us here. So now as this loads, you'll see that my conversation starters morning meeting shares file has been uploaded to Google Drive. And right now we're looking at it inside of Google Slides. Now it's really important to keep in mind that right now this is actually still a PowerPoint file. The way that I know that this is a PowerPoint file is you'll see right here, it says .pptx and it's Microsoft PowerPoint format. So I don't want to be editing this version. Instead, what I want to do is just go through a couple more steps. So next we're going to go to this file button in the top left hand corner and we are going to click on this option here that says save as Google Slides. What this is going to do is that this is actually going to create a new file that will convert this PowerPoint file into an editable Google Slides version. So I'm going to click on save as Google Slides and now it's loading in a new tab here and you'll see that I now have this Google Slides version that is completely editable. I know that this is Google Slides because I followed those steps, but also because I don't see any um, .pptx uh, text here. So I know that this is actually going to be a Google Slides file instead of a PowerPoint file. Now, sometimes when you walk through this process, you go through these steps, there occasionally might be some readjusting that you might need to do. First, if you are using a, if the PowerPoint file that you were using previously uses a font that isn't a part of the Google font library, you may need to change that font to something that looks similar. So sometimes the fonts will, won't transfer over perfectly. Your text will still transfer over, but you might notice that the font is going to be slightly different. So you might need to make some adjustments in terms of your fonts. And then another uh, adjustment that you might need to make that I've noticed in the past before is sometimes the text boxes kind of get um, adjust moved around a little bit. So you might need to make some slight adjustments in terms of the text boxes. But if we take a look at this file here, if I just go through some of these slides, you'll see that it looks pretty good. This is actually a conversation starters file that I have available in my Teachers Pay Teachers store. Um, but it looks like everything looks pretty good. 
So now this is going to be completely editable for me to use and access in Google Slides. Now let's go back to our Google Drive so I can show you what this looks like saved inside of your drive. So if I click on our Google Drive and we wait for this to load, you'll now see that there are two different files that are saved inside of this folder. First, we have this PowerPoint file here, this conversation starters and morning meeting shares .pptx. That is going to be the original PowerPoint file that we saved inside of our Google Drive. If you don't need this anymore, you can go ahead and delete it. Um, I'm just going to leave it here for the purposes of this video, but you can decide if you want to keep it saved in your drive or not. This now here is going to be the Google Slides version. Just as how you typically save Google Slides or share Google Slides with other people, you can share it with your colleagues, you can share it with your students, you can share it with anyone with a Google account, you can make edits just as you normally do. So this is just going to be a typical Google Slides file. So you'll see both of these are now saved in my Google Drive in the same folder. Now what we are going to do is we're going to walk through the opposite process. This is going to be a little bit quicker, how to convert a Google Slides file into a PowerPoint file. So if we open up that Google Slides version, again, this is the version that we just converted. If you would like to transform your Google Slides file into a PowerPoint file, it's very quick and simple to do this. You can do this with any Google Slides file. It doesn't have to be one that was previously PowerPoint. I am just gonna use the same file for this video, but you can use any Google Slides file to do this. I'm going to click on File in the top left-hand corner. Then I'm gonna hover my mouse over Download, and I'm gonna click on the option here that says Microsoft PowerPoint.pptx. Once you click on this button, it will convert this file, this Google Slides file, to a PowerPoint file that will save to your computer. So instead of saving to your Google Drive, this will actually download and save directly to your computer. You can also export this as a variety of different file types. I find myself choosing the PDF option quite often, um, but there's other file types here as well. But again, for this video, to convert Google Slides into PowerPoint, you're just gonna click on this option here and it will download and save to your computer. Thank you so much for watching today's video all about how to convert a PowerPoint file into a Google Slides file and how to do the reverse as well. If you liked this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and I'll see you back here soon. Bye friends.